Hello everyone, welcome back to my YouTube. I'm really sorry for not doing an introduction or an outro today. I'm not feeling too great, so I will just stick to the voiceover for now. So my evening routine starts um, normally with me or Jack will be tidying away the toys. We also take this time to sort through the toys because a lot of the stuff gets mixed up. Um, as you can see here, there is Lego with Paw Patrol with cars. It's just a hot mess and it drives me absolutely bonkers. So I will put it all away and then I carry on with the front room and I will grab a basket, like a laundry basket. And what I will do is put everything that shouldn't be in the front room in this basket. Um, obviously things like things that should be in the kitchen I will just quickly run through to the kitchen. But things that belong like in the bedroom I will take out and put in this basket ready to go in there. I don't touch the bedrooms in my evening routine. I leave that to the morning. The kids are light sleepers and I don't really want to wake them. And then once that's done, I will just give everything a quick dust with Dave. Give it a good old polish because our house is forever dusty. Also, do you like our new fish tank? And if you can spot the little fish tank and the big fish tank, we've got babies about to be born. <laughs> so then I will wipe down our dining table with Zaflora and water. I am absolutely loving the pink grapefruit at the minute. And then I will give it a quick hoover. Um, I know I said the kids are light sleepers, but this hoover is very, very quiet, which is handy. And then with the 1001 spray, just giving the carpet a quick freshen up. Once the front room's done, I will go over to the kitchen. And as you can see, Jack's not being very helpful tonight. <laughs> Story of my life. But what I will do is just fill up the dishwasher, put everything away, clean all the stuff up. I will hand wash a few bits and bobs. Um, and then once the sides are cleared away, I will give it a spray with the flora and water again, just to disinfect it all. The kitchen was a bit of a bomb site today, um, I must admit. It does turn into a bit of a dumping ground, this kitchen. I'm sure everyone has that one room in their house that ends up like this. Not just me. Hopefully, anyway. Once that's done, I like to take this opportunity to clean out my sink. Even though it gets dirty within minutes, I will still do it. And I will use the flash bathroom spray to clean out my sink dryer thingy majiggy. Don't know what it's called. And then disinfect the sink. Once I've disinfected the sink, you will see I go in with a SIF stainless steel spray that I can never pronounce. Um, and then just buffing it in with a microfiber cloth. Absolutely love doing that, even though it does get ruined so quickly. But yeah, I am dying to get a ceramic sink. I hate stainless steel sinks. <laughs> Once that's done, I will boil the kettle, um, you'll see in a second, and I will pop a capful of pink grapefruit flora in my sink. The reason behind this is um, I will then put all of my sponges in the sink, and then once the sponges are in the sink, I will put the boiling water in and disinfect them overnight. And excuse the disco lights, Jack decided he wanted a party, apparently. So yeah, that will disinfect all of my sponges and make them smell lovely. And then, yeah, literally carrying on, just cleaning all the sides, going from one to another until it's all finished. And giving the oven a quick whip wipe down. So yeah, I really hope you enjoyed this video. Please don't forget to like and subscribe, and I will see you in the next one. Hopefully I'm feeling better for an actual face-to-face -face intro and outro. I will see you all later. Bye!